De Canio takes it quickly. Minto. Good cross. Foe's there for West Ham. Corner. So uh, that deflection will give West Ham a corner, which De Canio will take. He's got one shot in the six-yard box. Foe to come in from the penalty spot, but he's played it short. Minto. Little ball into De Canio. Clever. Oh, what a goal! What an amazing strike by Paolo De Canio. Oh, that is spectacular and theatrical. And West Ham are level. They don't come any better than this. The angle looks awful, really, but he propels that like a missile into the top corner. And Mark Porn just had to stand there and watch it fly in. I, I, I want to say thank you to the lads. They helped me. They say, don't, doesn't matter, Paul. You are strong, you are good. Doesn't matter if you miss penalty because everybody could miss could miss penalty. So I say ten, but uh, when you do this in important games, of course, and the first time in my life I miss penalty, uh, just in important in important game. Not a game. It is not easy. You can say everything. You can uh, listen everything. Everything, but I didn't sleep for three nights. Really? Yeah, because I was very disappointed much to myself. people, the West Ham supporters in the future. Before I stop my career, we are going to win something because if we don't do this, I kill myself. <laughs> don't do uh, no, 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 don't believe me. No, 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 it's a joke.
Elliott. There's three up now, two on the right-hand side. Matthew looking clearance. Bonchop is just out there waiting again. He's goal-hungry today. This is it out to Decanio. Little bottle, round one, round two. He's buried it! Another quality strike from Paolo Di Canio. Somebody say in Italy, ah, a referee, a English referee is very bad because they never stop the game. In England, you, of course, you say, ah, Italian referee are bad because uh, every contact they stop the game is not for a man, you know. Uh, they can speak, uh, English people can speak because of different uh, rules, different. But uh, I, I choose play here, so I have to change. It's not referee's fault, or maybe the rules are, are, are wrong. No, I have to. I have to change it because if I want to play here, I have to respect this rule, of course. So for the first season in Scotland, okay, in Sheffield, was very hard for me to change everything because in Italy, when you have contact from behind, they stop the free kick easy. Here. Never, also when somebody put the foot in your face, but uh, this is the game in England. remains. Bradford look more and more comfortable as the game goes on. This ball could come through to Kitson. It does! Kitson! He must be pulled down! It must be a penalty! It is a penalty! Kitson, he made the run. Confident, determined, shrugging off O'Brien and then O'Brien all over him. I don't really think it was even as bad a challenge as the one on Di Canio earlier. But this time Di Canio and uh, De Canio and uh, Lampard arguing over who's going to take it. <laughs> I've never seen this before. They are arguing over who will take the penalty. What are they going to do? Both take it? <laughs> Lampard, I think, intelligently suggesting that De Canio might well not be in the frame of the mind, the right frame of mind to take it. But in the end, age has overruled uh, beauty. Let's just hope he doesn't miss it. De Canio to put West Ham back in this game. Well, we've got a bit of argument here between Sinclair and some, some of the Bradford defenders. I don't know whether they want Sinclair to take it. It's 65 minutes into this game. Well, if anyone can do it, De Canio can he? He missed his last penalty against Aston Villa. And I think that's why, for a moment, Frank Lampard was uh, having a few words. This can't be doing anything for the confidence and concentration of Di Canio. He said he'd never missed a penalty before. When he missed that one against Villa. He hasn't missed this one. It's 4-3. Especially as goalkeeper Aiden Davison guessed absolutely right. I say it every time what I think. And this team I found my atmosphere, I put atmosphere because they understand me. Because when I speak about this, I don't want to destroy the atmosphere because I want to help, help the too. team. So they understood me. The chef, nobody understood me because uh, they your English, didn't want... Your English is better now. No, no, no. <laughs> my English is still very bad, I know. But uh, my daughter, uh, she, she starts teaching, to teach me yeah. because she speaks very, very good English.
when they play, you know, easy for them. Like a play, enjoy with a friend. Every day I have two, three friends. She, she brings at home, or then after school uh, they play together, so I'm very happy. This is my dad, it's kind of like... No, no, no. <laughs> Every day she comes and... Hello, daddy! My, my friend, uh, maybe Marilyn, uh, she, she has a brother, she wants uh, your autograph. Okay, Ludi, okay, Ludovica, okay, every day. So, she brings a job at home. Homework. 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 the first time nor the second time striking perfection from Paolo Di Canio West Ham fans they are very fanatic fans you know they love so much the team uh, I'm very happy for them if uh, they can help on television uh, West Ham West Ham in a good way of course like uh, Paolo Di Canio goal of the month play in West Ham or maybe um, Frank Lampard in the in national squad play West Ham Joe Cole is the, one of the best talented play play West Ham I'm very happy Rio Ferdinand Trevor Sinclair they are the players Squeezes through, Minto all the way, crosses now.
No, I am. She person. Canute. De Canio. Sinclair. De Canio drifts off into the middle. Play on. Sinclair. De Canio. the scoring and it's Rob Tybury you can't take your eye off him for a minute just when it looked like it was going out of play Sinclair whipped it in and all Seaman could do was parry it out and De Canio found the corner I want to score Arctic because uh, maybe I'm waiting for that moment because uh, it's the, 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 the first moment for me because I never scored Arctic in my career so I want to uh, try before I finish my career. Thank you to everybody, all the Western supporters because uh, you you have support uh, the team uh, fantastic this season. No, Sorry because uh, I know we didn't qualify for uh, a European place but uh, I'm sure uh, we are going to work very hard for next season because uh, we we want to win something with you and maybe celebrate uh, maybe a pick up or what you don't have next season. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's not in the top six. I must be watching the wrong game every week because uh, he's just been absolutely incredible. And uh, he scored, I think. Um, but uh, no, we've come to expect that from him here at West Ham now. Given his brushings with the law, as it were, uh, was it a hard decision for you to make him captain? No, not at all. It was about as hard as it was, was to, to sign him. I had no doubts when I signed him. Everybody says I was, uh, you know, what was I doing signing Paolo Di Canio? What a fantastic player he's been. And I had no doubts about when I made him captain. Stevie Lomas, my captain, was injured, so give the armband to Paolo, and he's just carried on as he was before, and he's been fantastic. Thank you so much for uh, your support because uh, you you help me every time. Uh, I can promise to you only uh, every time I'm gonna play for uh, for you for with West Ham shirt. I'm sure and uh, I give uh, all the time 100, 200 percent because uh, I love play with the Hammers shirt. Sorry uh, for my language, for uh, my English, but next season when uh, we are going to win something, uh, I promise to you, I, I'm going to speak much better uh, with, uh, with that fake up up to my head, I hope. See you soon and uh, see you for uh, another great season. Thank you and bye-bye to everybody.